might say that I'm a loner But I just call it being free I am my heart's only owner Or at least I used to be everyone, I'm Marie from Southern Country Living and today I'm making an old-fashioned banana pudding and I hope everyone is having a fantastic day today. I had a hard time even finding any vanilla wafers and I did have to get an off-brand but I think they work just fine and I had to wait for my uh, bananas to ripen up so I think they're good and ripe now and so uh, let me get started on my um, easy banana pudding. Okay, I'm going to put in my sugar. The next ingredient is my flour. My salt. And one whole egg. And three cups of milk. I hope everyone is having good weather today. It's overcast here, but it's warm. Now then I'm going to add in four more egg yolks. I remember that this was the banana pudding that my mother and my grandmother and my aunt and everyone always made when I was little. Okay, now then I'm going to pour in the rest of this milk. I've got just a little bit of clumping with my flour. So I'm going to get this. And I'm going to put this on my burner and let it cook for about 15 minutes. Okay, I'm going to turn on my um, burner on low and um, keep stirring it pretty constantly for about 15 minutes. Alright, my vanilla pudding is thickening up now, so the trick is to keep it stirred constantly. Okay, alright, my uh, pudding has been cooking for 15 minutes exactly, and it's really good and thick now. I'm going to put just a little bit of it on my pan so my vanilla wafers won't stick, slide around. That's the word I'm looking for. Okay. 
So now I'm putting on my vanilla wafers. Kevin, was this a 9 by 13 pan? Uh, yes, that's a 9 by 13. Okay. I was hoping it wouldn't have the other one that I've got. <laughs> no, it's not your big one. Calvin gets my pans ready for me sometimes. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to cut up two bananas. Or slice two bananas. <laughs> I see a little hole right there. I don't like that. My aunt used to make these old-fashioned banana puddings, and I just loved them. <laughs> I usually make the fast and easy ones around here most of the time, don't I, Calvin? Uh, yeah. I like them just as good. Your grandmother it's... used to make these banana puddings, and my grandmother did too, and Mama, and they were so good. I just like to change it up every once in a while, don't you? I had planned on making this banana pudding um, last week sometimes, but my bananas were green, and then I couldn't find any um, vanilla wafers. <laughs> okay, so now then I'm going to drizzle this over my bananas. I'm going to make a meringue for this too, but some people, they don't even make a meringue. They just eat it this way. Okay, now then I'm going to um, put some more vanilla wafers down. So now then I'm going to put the last two bananas down.
I've got a kitty cat out here <laughs> right at my sliding glass doors. He's so pretty. Y'all wouldn't believe what his name is, Trouble. <laughs> but he doesn't look like he's a bit of trouble. <laughs> he's so pretty. Put my pudding on. That cat hates wanting something. <laughs> I think he's wanting attention. <laughs> he's probably wanting us to feed him again, and we can feed him after we get through doing our video. I heard that cat food around here was hard to get. <laughs> the people that own the cat, they feed him. He just comes down here to see what we're eating, I guess. <laughs> Sorry about this scraping. Let me get my other thing right here. It doesn't make that much noise. These pans do get heavy after a while. And this is my arm that's weak. <laughs> Okay, I don't know if I have enough to go all the way around, but I'm going to try a few.
Y'all, I'm getting distracted. My cats want the play. <laughs> Okay, let me get my hands washed, I'll wipe off, and then I'm going to do my meringue. Okay, I'm putting in four egg yolks, and I'm going to beat this until stiff peaks form. My egg uh, whites are done now, so I'm going to put it on my banana pudding. Okay, I'm going to put my meringue on my pudding now. Your meringue has to come all the way to the edges. Okay, I have my uh, meringue spread out on my pudding now. Okay. So I'm going to cook this at 400 degrees for about um, 10 minutes, and then I'll be back. Okay, my banana pudding just came out of the oven, and uh, it looks good. And I'm not going to do a taste test on it uh, today. Uh, it's got to cool off for a long time, and so uh, I know this banana pudding is going to be good because we've made this in our family a lot. Uh, my, like I said, my grandmother and aunts and Calvin's grandmother, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, just let this cool, and then me and Calvin will have a dessert later on tonight. <laughs> okay, my uh, banana pudding has cooled off. A little bit, so I'm going to do the taste test. Mm. <laughs> that is really delicious. It's just like I remember that my mama used to make. <laughs> and, um, Kevin, would you like to take a bite off camera? Mm. 
Uh, yeah, I'll take a test over that. Great. I know it's going to be good, Marie. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to get as big a bite as you did. Yeah, well, I wanted to get some banana, and so that just happened to be a big banana. Mm. <laughs> it, that is very good, Marie. I'm going to get one of these crackers now, vanilla wafers, and see how it tastes. Okay. Those vanilla wafers are okay. Just that you can just keep that. Brand is a good brand. Oh, okay. Okay, so uh, the um, I was going to say the vanilla pudding. <laughs> the banana pudding it tasted really good, and I I would give it um, probably a four and a half because I think it needed just a little bit more sugar in it. <laughs> but what did you think, Calvin? You know I'm gonna give it five stars because I love banana pudding. <laughs> that was delicious. <laughs> yeah, it was really good, wasn't it? It was. Okay, well. And I think the color on it turned out perfect. Yeah. You have to be careful when you're cooking them because they're easy to burn, aren't they? Yeah. And um, so I'm gonna close this video out now so I can get me some banana pudding. <laughs> So y'all do what you love and love what you do and we'll see y'all on the next video. Bye. We were young and we were free and running. Never bothered about what could be coming. Every day we danced and life was smiling. We were young and drunk in love. A few years later I have started thinking if it's just love it Thank you.